Meet Snoopy, the drone that can hack your phone and steal your data. Uh, London-based security researchers team at uh, Sense, Sense Post Research Labs have developed a drone called Snoopy that can steal your data and content from your smartphone with, without any knowledge. Basically, without any knowledge, basically. It's, uh, it's been developed, but they've been already having testers in London. So say if you're a resident of London and you see a drone ho 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 um, hover over you, you have the chances that your smartphone is being hijacked using Snoopy. Snoopy is currently tested, being tested in the London skies. The tests have been taking place over the past few days by security researchers from Senseport. And they intend to present their findings next week at the Black Hat Asia a cybersecurity conference in Singapore. Of course, big business because stealing people's data is big, very, very big business and selling it, of course. I see the technology embedded in the drone and it was it to took it to, uh, to look for a smartphone device with Wi-Fi so your phone is a, a majority of uh, people with cell phones they have that features already on I mean you can turn it on but majority of all cell phones already have that or send a sense look for Wi-Fi networks that have previously connected into once it finds a network in range it range it automatically can it already basically connects once it if I uh, figures out that you have Wi-Fi on your phone it basically connects it to your network to your wife, I'm sorry. It says Snoopy uh, then sends back the signal to the smartphone and pretends to be a Wi Fi network within which the mobile device connect earlier. As soon as the smartphone connects with the device, it, it is hijacked. Hackers can then intercept every signal the smartphone sends or receives, including your username, login for email account, social network, bank account, text message, web server, your visit mobile user preference. Uh, with Kinson, who developed a drone with Daniel Kirber at Sensor Post Reacher Lab, said he was able to uh, obtain username and password from Amazon, PayPal, and Yahoo accounts created for the purpose of reporting so that we can verify the claim without stealing their passport, which is BS. It's just done on purpose. Watch this video for a quick look at what Snoopy do. Let's see, this is a video of uh, what Snoopy does here. Wi Fi Security Part 2 Snoopy. And you can watch it on YouTube. Just uh, search YouTube Wi-Fi Security Part Two Snoopy. Cause uh, I'm not able to play with it obviously because of copyrights. You know, YouTube is big on that. Uh, collecting media, uh, metadata, device IDs, or network names is not illegal according to Electronic Frontier Foundation. Of course, not illegal because you're funded by the government. Of course, not. But intercepting credit card details and logging IDs will be will likely violate wiretapping and and identity theft laws. Oh, come on! These people are such a bunch of liars. They always like Sada. They say this and that, and then come back. Oh no, we're not able to. But it's just he just he just the individual who uh, came up with this says here, uh, front smartphone connects with hi uh, with his hijack uh, hackers can then intercept saying no smartphone sensor or, uh, or receives. Okay. This then is able to ha uh, basically just take all your personal information from your phone, your bank accounts, everything. Okay. It says here the in the person who created is uh Wikison and uh developed drone with Daniel Cooper at a sensor port research lab, sorry. He said they said that he we he was also able to obtain usernames and passwords for Amazon paper and Yahoo accounts created for the purpose of reporting so that we could verify the claim that without stealing for pass you guys already stole the information, so how's it not stealing? I don't know, these people are just a bunch of control freaks, you know, they they uh, and they create these stuff to send it to the government for uh, big money, of course, and they get government contracts and they get multi million dollar contracts to create this uh, type, uh, type of technology to steal people's information and could do other things besides just you know hijacking your phone and taking all your bank accounts and all this stuff. So, welcome to uh, police state. But this is in London, but of course, US have their own, you know. They don't really put it out there like yes, this is what we have. They they just keep on hush hush. But the US have the same thing. They they could hijack uh, your wife for information, and everything, which obviously is the NSA if we all know that. NSA hijack everything, personal information, Microsoft sells information to the FBI, uh your, your telephone company sells all information to the government, so it's that's that's the way it is. We have no freedom all. No freedom, it's nothing. You can never be free. You could set your mind free. Your mind could be free, 
But now your body, because at the end of the day, someone owns you. Someone controls you. Even with that be uh, right next to you, they control you either way because all the things that these big corporations, big banks do, you know, whatever you buy, everything's controlled. So, with that said, guys, uh, please uh, subscribe to my radio. Make sure you comment, share, and like. And uh, make sure you check out my previous radio in my playlist. Peace, guys. Be safe.